It's the King George VI and Queen Elizabeth Kiko stakes over a mile and a half, and they're off. And out of the stalls, Broom was a little slow and switches to the outside and is driven along Broom, going very wide as a day are got away strongly and Lone Eagle on the inside under Frankie de Torre. Uh, Love is just in behind those, uh, a touch keen early on, racing down the hill. And Mishriff is the early back marker. So they cover the first quarter mile and it's Lone Eagle on the inside of a day are. Without wide of these is Broom, who's recovered from that slow start to nearly lead the way now. Love is about three or four lengths back in fourth place and Mishriff is restrained at the back by David Egan. So heading on towards Swindley Bottom and on their way now towards the mile marker. And it's Broom and Wayne Lorden on the outside of Adaya and William Buick, who's been pretty keen running down the hill, the Derby winner. Lone Eagle has gone well round the inside, not uh, quite so keenly. And then back to Love and two lengths, two and a half lengths then to Mishriff. Into Swindley Bottom and Broom has got across now to the running rail in the hands of Wayne Lorden. From William Buick on a day are in second. Lone Eagle and Frankie de Torre content to take a bit of a trail now in third place on the inside of Love and Ryan Moore and then a couple of lengths to Mishriff as they begin to meet the rising ground. Heading on past the six furlong marker and on towards the five and it's Broom that leads the way by a couple of lengths to a day are in second. Lone Eagle, Love and Mishriff as they make the run towards the long home turn. Broom is the leader, the Grand Prix de saint Cloud winner from the Derby winner at Dayar. Lone Eagle second in the Irish Derby third. Then the five times Group 1 winner, Love on the outside, and the multiple international winner, Mishriff, at the back of the field. They begin the turn for home, and it's Broom that leads the way. A little bit loose on the lead. Leads by two and a half lengths to a Dayar in second place. Love moves up into third past Lone Eagle, and then Mishriff back into third inside the final three, and they turn for home in the King. George, his broom challenged now by Adaya, and Adaya goes up to Broom and puts his head in front. Mishriff charging down the outside, not doing Love too many favours. Then Lone Eagle, it's Adaya from Mishriff. Love struggling to get on terms as they race on towards the final furlong and a half. Adaya is holding Mishriff at the moment. Love trying hard inside the final furlong. Adaya for Godolphin and William Buick by a length and a half to Mishriff, and he's holding on. He's relentless, and Adaya the first horse since Galileo, the first derby winner since Galileo to win the King George and a jubilant William Buick.